Okay, next we're going to be working on lateral quick starts, right? And there's a lot of different techniques, but I'm going to teach them the one that's worked best for me over the years. And don't be afraid to put your own flavor on it, because if every player trained exactly the same, we'd have no difference. And difference is the spice to life in hockey, right? So I want to teach them the technique, but at the end of the day, I want Austin and Franca to put their own special flavor on it, because they're both different players. So what you guys are going to do is you're going to line up facing the net. So Austin, we're going to start you here lateral, toes at the net on the goal line. And then Franca, you're going to come back here. And the first thing we're going to work on is actually upper body. So I want you to disconnect when you're training. And I want you to understand there's a totally different technique downstairs than what's going on upstairs. And then I want to bring the two together. So I want you guys to just think about your upper body. If you're ready like me, what are the two things that have to snap? Eyes and arms to your. She meant twig. She said stick. She meant twig. Am I right? Sure. So the first thing they're going to do is they're just going to work on their stick snapping strong. It's not going to come out here sailing around, right? It's going to be a strong snap and their eyes are going to go with it, which brings your shoulders that connect to your hips and they're just going to jump over top. Okay, so now we have to take the upstairs through the core and connect it downstairs. So, same idea, but now they're going to be conscious of what's happening down here with the legs and the skates. This is my strong side, so I love ripping off my right edge. Right before I start, I might shift over just a bit and load it up. I've got the upstairs snapping, and now I want one hard crossover to get my body square to the other end with pop and explosion. Now with Franca, what we're going to do is we're going to kind of up the stakes a little bit, right? So I'm going to borrow Austin again. You're going to get one stick away from her skate. So touch your skate there with your blade. And you're going to chase her and try to pick her pocket before she gets to the far blue line. All right? But Franca is a very smart hockey player. And she knows if she can get that puck off of her stick or let the dog run off the leash, so to speak, she knows that gives her an opportunity to pump her arms in return giving Austin no chance. But the more she pulls it, the same speed she's going, she's giving Austin just a hair of a chance, but she is a lightning bolt skater. So Franca, when you take off in your quick start, I want you to punch that puck to open ice and go. Go! Hey everybody, Coach Ryan here, and thanks for watching the latest episode of DePraw Power Skating. If you enjoyed it, please hit that like button and leave all of your comments down below. And to make sure that you don't miss out on any future videos, please subscribe to the channel. And if you haven't yet, make sure you download your free copy of the Breakaway Blueprint. The Breakaway Blueprint is for anybody that is struggling to get that next gear in their game to finally break away be a dynamic skater and elevate your hockey game forever that's it for this one and as always like number 99 i hope you have a great one